Alright, I haven't finished the episode yet, but my guess is she's, she's gonna go back to her team. I'm just saying this right now, I already know where the plot's going. I'll check back with you guys later to see if that does turn up, because I know it's gonna happen. I feel like crying right now. Let's let's start with the story. <clears throat> so, Rainbow Dash, Moke Biceps, and Fluttershy are practicing to uh, participate in the Equestria Games. Um, uh, they seem to be pretty bad considering uh, Moke Biceps, Small Wings, and Fluttershy. You know. She's too shy. And so, um, they're at, they're at the participant, like, practice. They're practicing. And then, like, mm, Soren, Soren falls from the sky, like, uh, hurting his wing, but Rainbow Dash gets him. Like, he sprayed his ring, and he, he, sp he spray he sprained his wing, and he fell. Yeah. And Rainbow Dash comes and get him, and his ring hurts so bad, his wing hurts so bad that, they have to go take him to the doctor, and so what they do now is they, uh, uh, Spitfire, Spitfire's, the Wonderbolts are left without <clears throat> a third member, which they have to have, so they call him Rainbow Dash, but Rainbow Dash doesn't want to leave the Ponyville team, so they say that they can work for both of them, but they don't know if they're, uh, but Ponyville shouldn't know if, if, if Rainbow Dash was the Cloudsdale team, so, Rainbow Dash is practicing with the Wonderbolts and with Ponyville at the same time. And, um... Um... Sh um... Spitfire comes and says, Hey, uh, you, you, you know, you can join the Wonderbolts. We want you to join the Wonderbolts permanently since Soren's not gonna be flying with us. He won't recover in time. How about you join us, basically? And, uh, uh, Twilight knows that, Twilight knows that, and Twilight knows that she's, like, double-taking, and, um, um, she's right there when, when the Wonderbolts are telling, uh, Rainbow Dash to join them. But, um, um, they take, she's, um, Spitfire says, take your time, uh, just talk to us when you, when you made your decision. Uh, they go up, uh, they fly away, uh, Rainbow Dash asks Twale, hey, if you, if you were me, what would you do? And she said, I'm sorry, but I think this is a decision you're gonna have to make on your own. See, that's what we need of Princess Twilight. More of that, more of that, voice of reason, yes, that's what we need. Even though Spike was kind of the voice of reason, he's more of a comedy relief now, so Twilight shall be the voice of reason. And Applejack. Take your pick. So what So what Rainbow Dash does is... Oh my god, I'm so sorry. <laughs> she injures herself. No, she doesn't injure... She fakes her injuries by putting a lot of, like, um, band-aids, or not band-aids, but gauze all over her. And she has to go to the doctor... But they don't know what's wrong with her because, you know, she's not her. So then, both biceps. And Fluttershy walk in, and they're like... Uh, 
um, Rainbow Dash tells them that she faked the injuries. And what Snowflake and Fluttershy did, since they knew that they the, the, that they wanted to stay with the Wonderbolts, they get a replacement. And do you know who that replacement is? Derpy. No, no, it's not Derpy. It's, it's you, right? No, it's Derpy. They get freaking derpy. Megan McCarthy. She she even wrote on Twitter. Some fans will be screaming over tomorrow's episode. Hashtag MOP season 4. And she even made this post about muffins. She's like, I bought these muffins the other day. But I don't know if they're going to go bad tomorrow AM or not. Megan McCarthy. You, you, you badass you. So. They, um, Rainbow Dash goes up and shows the, them that she was never injured and that she wants to stay with Ponyville and they learn from their mistakes and what happened with with Soren is that they didn't want him on his team because they didn't think he'd be like 100% so they made him fake his injury to get out so they can have ramp so they can have another pony join them which just happened to be Rainbow Dash and so Rainbow Dash felt bad and now Soren he's a uh, he's back on their team and now Rainbow Dash is back with Ponyville. Yeah, sorry, Derpy. Rainbow Dash has to join in and screw up everything. Uh, you know how that went last time. I mean, I be I think she got her revenge from the last roundup. So, um, they fly through the swings. Uh, bulk biceps is like uh, trying to, you know how tiny his wings are. It's like, uh, uh, Trying to squeeze through the hoops, Rainbow Dash runs and gets to the finish line just in time. And they are now participants in the Olympic Winter Sochi 2014 Equestria Games. Yeah, the end. And Derpy comes in with a shot. Oh, okay. I know I missed a couple things, but let's talk about that in the thing that I liked. Derpy fucking who's that? That. <laughs> I gotta appreciate uh, Hasbro for doing that. Even though they didn't give her a speaking voice, they did acknowledge her eyes. Well, they didn't acknowledge her eyes, but they did make her eyes like that. So, you know. Let's have all the soccer moms complaining now. I mean, she's not talking at least. She's in the back. She she isn't in the background. She's in the front. She's right there with the main character. She's like, and she's holding this flag. And Derpy has significance. Look, she's holding this flag. She holds this flag. That. When they're done, they put it on the floor, and Rainbow Dash is still in the bed in the hospital. And she looks at the flag, and she sees that same rainbow thread that was in um, Rarity Takes Manhattan. And her eyes go on. Her eyes go uh, rainbow like, like how it went in Rarity Takes Manhattan. Key? And you know what's further further proof is in the ending when they get their medals that they can be in the Equestria games. Um, at the end, uh, the medals right there on Rainbow Dash, and you can see the zoom in on the symbol. That same rainbow effect. Conspiracy time. That has something to do with the keys. You cannot lie. That has something to do with the keys. Anything else I liked? Uh, I like the kind of kind of like twist. You know, I said at the beginning of the video, like I wasn't done watching the episode, and I kind of predicted where it was gonna go, and I was kind of right. I thought she was just gonna be like, "I'm sorry, but I like to. I want to go with my team because they're my friends." Oh wait! Oh wait! Oh wait! Hold on. Uh-huh. So, yeah. Anything else? Well, I like, I like Twilight now, because, you know, she wasn't really acting like royalty. I mean, she couldn't even get a cab in Rarity Takes Manhattan. I mean, what the heck? But now, she's kind of the voice of reason, and I kind of like this approach with her. Up. Uh, it's a nice approach, even though Applejack was kind of it, and yeah, even Spike was kind of it. I like Twilight filling this role. 
Anything else? Um, I like the Wonder Bolts. The Wonder Bolts are, are cool. Uh, I like Spitfire. Um, I like Sora, and I like whoever the guy in the middle, or girl, <laughs> whoever that girl in the middle is. Um, uh, the animation is good. The flying, you know, all that stuff. And, and um, wing-ups. Obviously, push-ups with wings. <laughs> Just imagine Snowflake trying to do that. We're, I called him Snowflake again. Bulk biceps. So that brings me to things I don't like. I don't like the name Bulk Biceps. Why can't you just stick with Snowflake? I mean, what's the point? Why call him Bulk Biceps when you already had a name for him, Snowflake? But the character Bulk Biceps is not on this cons. It's on the pro. I really like it. Bulk Biceps. He is really funny. He used to be my favorite background pony. And then Derpy was my favorite background pony. And now we see the two collide right here in this episode. And it's just... So... Anything else I didn't like? Um, I think the writing felt a little wonky at some times. I mean, it wasn't precise what it wanted to be like. It could have been paced better. Um, anything else? Alright. Conspiracy time. I think I saw some griffins. I think I saw some griffins. I don't know if I saw griffins, but I think I saw some griffins. If you guys see griffins, tell me. Um, so yeah. Conclusion after this 12 minute episode. God damn. Or 12 time down there somewhere. Um, I really, really like this episode. This was a great episode. Apple sold. This is a great Apple sold. Yeah. Next Apple Jack episode we get, I'm calling that the best Apple sold. No. Apple soda. No, this is the. this is a great episode. <laughs> Um, I really like the writing, even though it could be wonky at some times. I really like the one bolts, derpy freaking hooves, bolt biceps. Um, Rainbow Dash, yeah, she's really nice. Um, derpy fucking hooves. Um, Twilight's Voice of Reason, derpy fucking hooves. Um, anything else? Uh, animation was great, derpy fucking hooves. How many times do I have to emphasize? Is that? Well, I think that's it for me. I would give this episode, believe it or not, 10 out of 10. Would watch again. So, uh, what's next? Three's the crowd, Discord, count me in. See you guys next time.